like toy for my dog. Um, he's a little bit of an aggressive chewer. So I just got him. Oh, it smells. Oh, it smells like a tire though. I did like some research on really good toys for like aggressive chewers. And apparently, Go Nuts are really good for dogs that are aggressive chewers. This feels super tough. I think it's made out of like a soft rubber. So I'm gonna open this for him. In this household, we don't buy one thing for someone and not the other. So I have two dogs. I have a puppy. He's like six, but I call him a puppy. I have a senior dog. So I got him a blanket because he loves, you know, he's a senior dog, he's always sleeping. I got him like a really soft blanket. I just got like a paper towel holder. It's just a black paper towel holder. Some more got to be. I love this. I need something to make your edges last all day. Get this. They will not move. I got this for my makeup. I mix a lot of things like on my hand, like my blushes. I mix my um, liquid blushes on my hand. I just got like a palette thing um, so that I don't have to put it on my hand. I could just put it on here. It also comes with a little mini spatula. I really like this side. And then has this side as well. I also got these really tiny eyeliner brushes. I think these are actually made from nail art, but I got them for eyeliner. They're super tiny and thin. I love really thin brushes for my eyeliner. And then I got like two mini um, jewelry boxes. So cute. Size reference. This is my hand. This is how big it is. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. First of all, the packaging is so cute already, like the black and then the green. The minis, and these are the full size. Is because on their website, they have so many different colors you can choose from. But my artist brain got me thinking, if you have all the primaries and then you have white and black, you can make any color that you want. If you know color theory, like if you know the color wheel and how colors work together, you can get any color that you need. As you just saw, I just unboxed my new gratitude journal and my affirmation cards. Okay, so basically, I was watching Arrington, Arrington's video and watching him really inspires me to take better care of myself and I was really at peace with myself and I want to get back to that. I took psychology and in my psychology class, my professor basically taught us that Writing down what you're grateful for every night can really change your mindset. I did that for an experiment for a class, and I really saw um, really positive um, benefits to it. It really allowed me to ground myself and to slow down and to think about the things that I'm really, really grateful for. I want to practice that mindfulness again and create a space where I can ground myself and focus on what I have around me. You know, as a person with really bad anxiety, sometimes my mind escapes to the future. It escapes to all of the worries. And first of all, writing things down really helps me. Um, I would recommend anyone to get like a little journal or notepad. I just have to write things down. I have so many things going on in my mind and I need a journal to write things down. So I keep a sketchbook with me everywhere I go and it's really handy. I decided to get this five minute journal. Thank you.
Look at my roses. Do they look so cute? You ready for class? Um, class back. I don't know what I'm gonna wear today. Y'all. Oh, it is so beautiful. Y'all, I don't know what to wear today. I really like this though. I was gonna wear this. Okay. Don't mind. I'm on my lips. I'm eating a kimchi soup, so my lips are red. But, oh my gosh. And it's like spicy, so like I, I can feel the spice. Like I don't understand. I don't know if that makes sense. But um, I found a way to style it. It's real cute. And I also put on these to kind of go along with this. So, yep. I love this necklace. I love the sound that it makes. Like I like this sound. I don't know. Um. So yeah. That's the necklace. It's super cozy. I really love the um, yellow with the gray. He's one of my favorite rappers, so I wanted to buy some of his merch. So, I really love all of his albums. His albums are so good. I want to go to his concert, but, like, no one else that I know likes his music like that. I would basically be going alone, and I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> I don't go on a, like, solo date to, like, the movies or to, like, a restaurant, but to a concert, I don't know. Put that on my own, on my, on my. Mm, I look high. Ooh, okay, I have received yet another package. What's right, so y'all? I love how you can recycle all their packaging. I really like that. Oh, this is perfect. I'm so glad. They have so many, um, I feel like I look so gross. I look the best right now, y'all. I just got back from class, so maybe the school air is still affecting me. I don't know. This texture is so nice. I know you cannot tell through the camera, but oh my. Put that on my own. Oh, mama. Victoria Slade on that song. I'm not even playing with you. I got these two tops. I think this is Home Stretch. This is so pretty. I love gray. I think it looks really nice. Also, y'all, I painted my nails. Y'all. Who am I? Like, years ago, I would never paint my nails this color. I'm so proud of, like, how much I step out of my comfort zone and I explore new things. Because I would never have painted my nails this color, and it's so pretty. So pretty. The material is so nice. This this is so comfortable. Oh, my gosh. That's my haul, y'all. stores because it was really chaotic and also I was with my family but I will do a haul so first I went to Sephora I've been wanting this palette for a long time um
Yeah, but I got this Anastasia Rose Metals palette. And then I also got the Cosmos palette. I saw this. I was like, oh. I've been wanting it for a while. So when I actually saw it, I was like, wait. That's the palette that I really liked. The Rose Metals palette is beautiful. It's like shimmery earth tones. It is so pretty. Shimmer always gets me. Like if they add a little sparkle, they got me. This is a really heavy white robe. Next, I got another dress shirt. I love dress shirts so much. And it's the perfect fit. Next, I just got a box to put my eyeshadow palettes in. And lastly, from Target, I just got some black jeans. Um, I really needed a pair of jeans that don't have holes in them and that are comfortable for me. So, got some black jeans. And of course, they have to be wide leg. Like, I only wear wide leg. Only, I only wear wide leg jeans, yo. The last place for today was Urban. From Urban, I got this. I kind of saw this last minute and I just grabbed it. I really like the texture of it. But yeah, this is really cute. I love the men's section in Urban. Like, I just love the men's section in general. I go in every section. I don't care if it's the kids' section, women's section. First of all, I don't think that sections should be gendered. I think if you just like the clothing, just get it. Like, I don't think... I don't really know why there's a women and men's section, but there is. So I just kind of bounce back and forth. Let's just see how it fits. Okay, I can get into... Yo, okay, yo, I can get into this. This is cute. I imagine the pink thing not on it, but this is really cute. Like with a white top or something. Next, when I saw this, first of all, I'm really liking Urban. I think Urban is like my store now. It's really expensive. But I love the style of clothing that they sell in there. It's kind, it kind of reminds me of like a parachute um, skirt. And I've been wanting a parachute skirt for so long. And the color, I know I need to just show you. But the color, it's beautiful, y'all. It has these little like kind of ties on it. It is so cute. Okay, next, y'all. They had the parachute pants. In previous vlogs, I've worn these green parachute pants. They're literally my favorite pair of pants. They're so comfortable and they go with literally everything. Okay, but first, I saw the white ones. I got the white pair. I don't, I don't think y'all understand how much I love these pants. They're so comfortable. They feel like clouds. And I really love these ties. This is what really drew me into these pants in the first place is these ties, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, you can buy any size that you want, but you can tighten them. I just, I don't, I just love these pants so much. So I got a white pair. And then I got a black pair because I, I just, I had to. I really like Urban Outfitters t-shirt section. I had to, I had to, I had to. I was like, I spice. I was like, Miss Spice, I have to. Yeah. Hey, Betty, she's showing her. She's shaking like her name bands in, but also shaking in the. Oh, I had to, I had to, I had to. Like, yes, Miss Spice. And then lastly, I got this top that just says human on it. I really liked it. What is she? I'm sorry, Paul. There's no other way! Well, what country is this? Wow. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. These are all cream bronzers. These are all cream blushes. I also ordered the blush book. So pretty. Wow. Okay, they're kind of shimmery. I see like shimmer. This is what they look like. It's essentially a blush book. So pretty. Oh my gosh. This one right here. I'm excited for like all the shades, but mainly this yellow blush and this right here. Pink skies is beautiful. And then this yellow. Oh my gosh. And then strawberry mojito. 
and then pinkies right here. I can't see it. Like, right there, pinkies. Wow. This is what the blush book looks like. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to use that yellow. I just wanted to quickly show you my flower haul. I got this from a flower market. <laughs> the smell is so strong. I originally went because I'm taking a botany class assignment. We have to um, identify and like analyze plant structures and, like or parts of a flowering plant. So I just got um, lilies for that assignment. And then I saw all of these and I was like, I have so. They're so pretty. Like, I just love this green and red. My mom's favorite color is blue. So I think they like spray paint flowers because they had like a rainbow one. It was really pretty. Um, but I got her a blue rose. I got two vases. I got this brown one. It's super cool. Like, I just love it so much. And I got this yellow one. It's so pretty. Y'all, this is the best art purchase I've made this year. Oh. My gosh. For my final, it's a multimedia project. So I'm going to use soft pastel and color pencils. So that's why I bought this. And we have like a restricted palette. We're only allowed to use three color families out of the um, color wheel. And you can use any different like shades and tints throughout that color family. Isn't this beautiful? You know, obviously you can't really see my blush today on this side because I have that black eyeshadow. I'm gonna use um, use my blush palette from Makeup Revolution. I'm gonna use this like light pink shade. I mean, maybe today wasn't the best day to try this out because usually my blush goes right here and I have a star right there. So I'll try this palette again, but I feel like my signature is my blush. Like, I just love blush so much. Like, I want to look unreal. Like, even part of me doing this makeup, I was a little like, oh, like, I'm scared to go to class. But, like, I literally go to art school, okay? Th that is the place to have e experimental makeup, to have experimental fashion. Like, I feel like I have all the places in the world. I feel like you may feel less judged being yourself in an art space. Th it, they still may be judging. But I just feel like, you know, we're all we're all a little weird. All of us artists, we're all a little weird. And I feel like I should not feel, you know, I don't know. Like, makeup is so personal to me. It's so fun to me. And I love to just really, really, really express myself through makeup. But I really get nervous showing other people, like, my creative looks and stuff like that. Because I'm like, I don't want you to judge me. But it's literally makeup. It's literally paint that you put on your face. So I shouldn't be scared. Okay. I'm gonna use Strawberry Mojito. It's so pretty. Let's see. Okay, I like that. I need to hurry up and go make my lunch for class. Okay, I like this. Okay, this one's pretty. But now I feel like I did way too much blush. I always like to say there's no such thing as too much, but use this palette and it's literally so nice i'm a gloss girl i love gloss i'm gonna use these like elf glosses these are so good yesterday i was running errands for like a couple of hours and this stayed on the whole time 